Welcome to a 10-minute restorative yoga by the mini meditating dragon. Restorative yoga is a lot more relaxed. You'll stay in poses for a little longer. It could be either a cool down from a workout or on its own, whatever you'd like. We'll come on the knees here. Inhale the arms up overhead and exhale, placing one arm on the ground and then reaching the other arm up overhead. Holding here and breathing. Maybe coming out of the forearm. You don't need to, only if you'd like to. Walking your hands over to the other side, placing the other hand on the ground with the other hand up and overhead. Maybe coming out of the forearm if you'd like to. Walking to center, then breathing up the spine, one vertebrae at, the t at a time. And then start rolling your shoulders backwards. So forward and up by the ears and down the spine. And then reverse this motion. So up the spine, towards the ears and down the chest. Maybe going back and forth, whatever you'd like. Coming onto your knees, I'm just going to turn so you can see a little bit better. Going to try to bring your fingertips behind you. If this bothers your knees, feel free to have a blanket underneath your knees or your ankles. Just opening up the chest. From here, placing one leg out, flexing the foot, and then sitting back into a child's pose. It's a nice stretch for the hamstring. Coming high onto the knees and then switching sides. From here, sitting down, swinging both legs in front of you, breaking them into butterfly. So bringing the soles of your feet together, knees are out to the side. You're going to fold forward. Maybe taking a straight, uh, maybe taking a straight back. You don't have to. Again, this is restorative yoga. We're not trying to push ourselves here. From here, scooting the feet forward about six inches, and then bringing the hands underneath the knees, cupping the feet, and then curling the back.
Coming out of this pose and rolling onto your back. Keeping the legs how they are. You might just come onto your forearms, you might come all the way back. Just relaxing here, allowing gravity to open up your hips. Maybe you'll close the eyes. Imagine as though you're sinking into the mat. Maybe bringing your knees together and twisting over to one side. Nice, gentle spinal twist. Maybe taking it to the other side. From here, you're going to bring your knees into your chest, making any other movements that you'd like before entering into Shavasana. Yes, I know it seems pretty early to go into Shavasana, but that's okay. It's part of restorative yoga. You can take any other movements that you'd like. It's totally fine but make your way into Shavasana within about 30 seconds. Allowing yourself to rest, allowing yourself to sink down into the mat. From here, taking your first conscious breath, making small movements to awaken the body, and make your way up to a seated position. Maybe taking meditation or taking a little bit more time to reawaken the body. Taking about 20 seconds to make your way into a meditative space. Seated, seated at the top of your mat with your hands and heart center. Blinking the eyes open. Inhale, arms up overhead. Exhale, bringing the hands to heart center. Thank you for sharing your energy with me today. Namaste. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.